position to get some big wins. But also, Sen fans should be rooting on for Lev here because G2 getting wins is bad for Sen at the bottom of the table. So all of these kind of things. And listen, one of our big stories is going to be who can shut down Aspas? Is he just going to run rampant? And immediately he goes down. Yeah. Mazzino baited into making another reclear. This is looking good at the beginning. One of the questions I had was that who was going to be shutting down the monster player that is Aspas? Now, Leaf, wait, is that? Hold on, hold on, hold on, wait, hold the on. Defuse. There's, defuse. There's no way! There's no shot! There's no, They're that's... getting away with that! That's a 5v3! Oh, there are two players that would die to one shot of Aspas as well. So there's still going to be this pressure to get the plant down. Timing to take the fight, King. He's dropped Trent. These rifles are not really doing too much at all. They swarm the position, they've got them surrounded. There's not a single avenue that's open for him. Jonah P is going to offset and contend with way too many players there. Three in a row. Leaf still has two cages. He can cage this off, open the door, put a lot oh. of pressure on these players. Close here. No way. Just a dry swing and peek for that mid round information. Not set up with the util yet. Comp, he still survives. Leaf didn't look at that for a kill, cage. and yet Leaf was not really? able to survive. That horse lurk. This is just a. falling to pieces. Rattled. That's how G2 are going to be feeling. Bounding. Sending in that long range artillery, but Mazzino eager to not make any noise. Just Tech. waiting for the rest of his team, trying to play inside this pit and that flank attempt while well, it does pay off. Tex taking out Valin. They still have to deal with a lot of obstacles that are here, but that lights them all up towards the back of the site. Leaf is doing dirty work here all around the map and the site. Struggling, contending. How will of turning this? Jonah P. Not again. Last one left inside the pit, but this time the molly is correct on the course. And a spray down as well, anticipating that fight. That's a red ball clutch and a wonderful turning point for G2. The kills are going to be able to get here, though, with the deep darts over and away. Clone dodged, juked with the cages, really just making this one hard to collect any sort of kills, but they are flooding in the direction of left for now. Updraft. Dodging away and avoiding! What is that adjustment? Aspas right now will not be denied! And this guy is just flexing on him! I'm gonna corner aware that Leaf is already just gonna be playing tucked into it. He doesn't actually have any util. Snake by two clear it. Hunter's Fury forwards. Leaf finds a first fight with Hunter's Fury as well. These plays, they cannot stand their ground and shoot back. Lev putting it difficult now. Snared up into the side. Aspas seeking that rifle. Pressing forwards now to 2v2, and they know exactly where Valin is. Dashing forward, start rebounding. It's absolute chaos here, but what can Aspas do against it, North? It's free for his team to now take and get into the post. One of the problems with Leviathan's retake in the previous oh, round is that they didn't have people flanking. Spike that down. angle is filthy. Just sees right over the top of the high tide, so they assumed it was a safe plan. Not yeah. the case. Flash, peak, icy in the back, but it's anti-flash, dodged. So, you know... Looking far too. Three players. Leaf's gonna have to do an awful lot of lifting here to try and make this one winnable. Such a large disadvantage. Now time is being bled off the Play clock, but they're losing out these duels, and the lineups still gonna be played from afar already. Mazzino sticking gets his half, and it doesn't even matter. No more players will come into round 12 with a bad buy. Last chance to do something. Mazzino not being faked out there by the clone, but. I mean, I see he's playing anti. Tex follows through now with a Hunter's Fury. He's going to be chasing all sorts of kills. The Cove making it difficult, but well, the Cove will not withstand that kind of pressure. It's galvanizing. Oh, this is just... See if they set him up for the next one. Can he drive the dagger into the heart of his former team? Yeah, no to run, no to hide. It was calm eventually. Every single position and angle. I mean, with the classic, how much work is this guy doing? And the dodge and Duke can duck away from these shock darts up onto the ropes. Jonah P does win that fight out. This is a great start for G2. Advantages to be found, and they are making it nice and clean. That's fast. Last, Last one now. Try and push them all back here. Only five more bullets left, and there's no easy shots, no easy targets. Valin now sticking that to fuse, and guess what? Not planned it for him, but the co in place. It's a pistol round wrapped up nice and pretty there from G2. That's where Icy has the gate crash. Yeah. It's well thought out. Do they think about Leaf? This is where the high tide was pointing. Oh, oh it's just not what expecting awareness. it. But yeah, great awareness from Tex, knowing that that was a slight gap. Had to be recleared here. Now Lev can make their moves all the way over. Valin, though, outlaw in hand. Two shots will do it. Mollies have to be dodged and duped and avoided and evaded. But not the bullets. Tex is just lighting them up right now. Tries to help you hunt yeah. down the final one. They know where he is, Jonah. P shots. Landing. <laughs> that is the night. I mean, Asmus just stealing it away. Different angles.
Now, the difference was on the pistol, Tex also went down, so that trip was disabled. Spotted on the shoulder, Tex wins that fight. No off left immediately, but Valen, what a response from him. I Means just three kills toppled like that into the main executing. And we talked about it, it was the difference maker last time. The double swing is lovely with the coordination. All caught to perfection and rinse and repeat, I suppose. Mazzino. And shy of the time, so Mazzino. Sticking the plan, finally gets a bit of a run on, and there's the kill, okay! And squeeze through from the main players. They are not looking towards it. Hopped up, get the info. Just barely in ahead, but missed out with the Blade Storm. Hunter's Fury will relieve quite a lot of this, Jonah Pedo. Weave it in and out, but the Phantom Spray just can only do so much. Worried about it yet, this flank potentially being heard here by Leaf Reckoning. Used to take this space up and scale quite fast onto the approach. King has already caught himself One a kill. Already with that rifle that has been dealt in and it only just being dealt with. Despite being planted, Leaf is getting a move on here. He's not really being shy about it, not really obfuscating any sense of his positioning. And just not ready to collect that kill, so it's a thrifty win for Lev. From Aspas and Com is very disguised. Look at the player arches, they're all looking at the site. Now, only just now, thinking about the midler. And they've lined up perfectly for him. Look, Come on, Aspas. So good. They're tearing them to pieces. I mean, they'll be using their own high tide against them to get into that top mid angle as well. Left. Just a bait and switch, Valin. Really just seeking to pluck him apart, and that shock dart's pushing him back and away. Mazina with the plant and a pit to play within. Should be a done deal, except leave. No! Oh, yeah, just util out at a very wrong timing. Hopping around the place, man. He's seeking an avenue, a kill, anything at all. And he is making it look relatively fancy. Under Aspas updraft for the info, high ground angle played, 5 HP to Leaf's name, sticking half, already gained, can he get any? Not quite at all. It's Aspas, he shuts down that attempt of heroism, man, and so map one. Okay, so now Leviathan need to look behind them, or try to react forwards. Com seems to be prepping a recon for Aspas to push. It is incredibly deep and aggressive onto the angle and approach, but he has just skewered the man. <laughs> Sheriff in hand. He lets it sing. Jonah P. It's quite a good job, honestly, of just trying to shore up. The offense here onto the retake. Leaf now is alone in it. Spots out the one and the second. So he's got to know these players' positions, but he needs to find the kills of only five bullets to do it with. Spraying him through. Needs to get that reload online, but doesn't Don't anticipate this angle from the back. Doesn't know where to look. With the spike taking away time, has ran too short for it. So Leviathan up one round here by winning that opening pistol. Onto the side. Valen. He's going to be one to watch. Lowered angles, high tide rips its way through and across, and he wins the fight. Guarding the angles, it's a flood attempt here. His time's running really damn short, really damn low. Can even get themselves onto the side to get this plant online. Where is a very safe plant? Leaf's not going to be able to disrupt. Now, are they going to be able to double up? Where are these bullets flying through? Right through the screen, Leaf wins it out just as we were talking about that head to head battle. Matters into his own hands here. G2. Does Lev have any tools to break it? Now Mazzino, that's his cue, ends up sending the reckoning, hello, fight! I mean, just startling and scaring each other there, but I see he doesn't win it against Text. Valin, a wide face there, just trying to dodge and avoid the stuns, the worst sent flying, vulnerable up, but it doesn't matter. Ever win it out with a gunfight. Oh, Jonah P. Okay. Snakebite actually takes down Mazzino, who gave his life and the cove to get the plant. A real chance here, I mean, Jonah P. Lurks his way up top, but the angle's watched for by Com here. Pitt's going to be covering it. It's a blight on the map as well, and it gives the right angle here for Aspas. Of the HP, Tex is forward now with the rest of his team. Over the top of the ropes here, and they don't want to slow down in the slightest. Molly's might make this one a little bit tricky and a little bit awkward still. Going to hold down that crowd, Aspas. It's delivering death one blow after remains. death blow. This guy is just... Unstoppable. He still don't have the ult online. Not that it'll particularly matter for this round. Snake bites. Not quite gonna land into the corner here, but with the star, oh, they just think it's entirely cleared up here. Leaf! How's he manage that? Two kills. Just with the sheriff can't quite manage the third, but definitely damage being done left by instantaneous on the response. But it's a 1v1, just like that. Flip of a coin. It's a game of that timings wrapping around. Just a crate, a tap. Not quite, just full Thanks stick in this one. Pretty. Swinging so wide! <laughs> <laughs> he whips his head clean off! 
no golden beams of light in the air, so they know it's relatively free. But now sent out by G2, Hunter's Fury, Trent. At this particular angle, Aspas trying to go for that same spot once more that just did all that damage from behind the flank. It's all synced up. In the chaos of the situation, Leaf is striking them right where it hurts. Zeno can't reset the aim and doesn't even expect the second player. Yeah. Surely these advantages flow in the way of G2. I think that's got to just be spammed through smoke, right? King must have bloomed his Viper off. Got a thing! Oh, that's one. insanity occurring. I mean, G2 just like that. You talk and talk and talk. But Lev being this will be the team. And then just like that, G2, they answer back in kind. Aspas trying to dash and make something of it. It's a flawless round. Lots of opportunities to make this difficult for G2. The drone's it's... already in. Did it tag onto Mazzino? It did. Gonna pee. To get that early tag. Forces out of shock darts. How do you get around this? Difficult to chew through and work through. It's a really hard pit, man. I mean, it just obfuscates all the available angles. Wingman sticking onto the fuse here, but broken. Dwindling. But the chances here might be able to get some exit kills, but really that's all about it. So, as foretold, expected left to be winning that one with that ult advantage. And they have a shock, Molly, and Nano. And all of that's going to be delaying. Creeping towards inevitability here for Levia Tan. The players are going to be toppling out towards the back of the side. Aspas cleaned up 3v3, but again, it's that util. How do you deal with these players and awareness? Leaf is running rampant right now. Spraying through, going to break this code. Already the few stuck all the way. And that's G2 making it nice and pretty. Six to six. Oh, yeah, but only 30, 30 seconds left. left, and Lev have got the right read on this one. You can tell it. The high tide. They want to seek to fight this one and disrupt this plan before it can even go down. It's going to come down to the bullets. Spraying through along with the util. Denied in the moment. So now, G2, they do have to get that move on. Picking up the spike here. Dizzy up at the top. Not watched for. It's not even broken, but the right clicks. Mazzino doing his best to sell Quite copies planted. and countless amounts of the bundles here still. Icy presses forwards. He's tucked though. His position is noted. Has to be the combined mic and remaining. swing. 1v1. Leaf versus King. Tapping away, Leaf! Flood defense set up to go. Man. To get this plant online, and here's the flood out through the cove as well. He'll take it into the right hand side and approach over the rafters. The turn of the pieces, man. And again, it's out of leaf. It's a 1v1, just like that. Him versus Aspas, and how much have we talked about it? This head to head. He has taken the timing forwards on the rope silently as you go, Aspas. Any sort of expectation, he adjusts it. Up top, though, it's a high low setup here with a reckoning forwards. They want to try and fight this one, Lev. Really getting active now into the mix, trying to take that initiative, Jonah P. Just a fadeaway shot there, I think, maybe even getting slowed down in a moment, but he does find his target here, sprayed through into the cove. G2 trying to fight over this one, tooth and nail, but the util is here. Now the lockdown, it's perfect timing for Lee. They're gonna have to go. And they have to go fast here, cove has to be broken, and it is indeed. Everybody just getting chewed up, chopped up onto that defuse spot. Aspas, I think a bit of a lead. Being pushed back away from it. Up. I think this is probably a situation where you want to just. Uh, I mean, going for the spam kills. I mean, vulnerable Dub Leaf. Just locking standing. down that angle. This guy is on fire right now. Aspas. The op over the king and see, pop the blade storm, see what he can do. But they didn't even want to commit to that. Oh, and he's not oh, going to be able to save the Aspas. At least he's got the blade storm to work with in the next. So it's the raves of all that util emanating out. Out of Lake Lurk as well on top of it. Leaf is really causing that distraction behind them. They've got so much to worry about right now. And how do they really even deal with it? Task pass forwards here. The Blade Storm shut down in his place here. Up to 12 now for G2. The Sova behind Yellow. Just the off angle here in the movements. There's Com going to be a backup policy right from the back here with the Guardian in his face, but he's blinded up. King Tex seeking that timing. He's walked up right past even the wall. High tights on high tights again. It cuts up these angles, and it's an unfortunate one here because Mizzino just doesn't realize that he's not even set up for that fight here. But as it fades away, doubled up. They were able to make that one happen. Valin making noise now up through the flank here. They've got to try and deal with him in a dash to disengage and away. Fading through. Lockdown needs to be broken, and I see. Delivers that death blow. That's a 13 8. Flourish and finish. Tucked through tree and they pushed them back and away paranoia i see not looking behind him again his back is being covered here aspas what is that adjustment really a flick of the wrist whatever you want to call it he has just opened up the site that's a ridiculous kill 
Icy should have had that one, but Leaf responds. Leaf oh. up top. It's nice and fast into the action, isn't he? Right into the fray here. Two versus three. Still have to have some more magical moments, and Trent, he delivers one. one right into that lax here still. Leaves it to Leaf. And he had a monster class <laughs> performance! <laughs> What is that kill? It's traded by King. To come alive into this one. Maybe he can make something happen for the rest of his team, but there's still smokes in the way. They want to clear out rubble. They want to clear techs first. This is a, a new protocol the that techs. teams are adding on the retake. It's too much to clear, really. Four of them eventually trading him out. It's barely there, but how much more have they really got? The util. It's sent flying forwards and away. Messina still with a high ground position, but he tucks away just at the wrong time. Aspas dropping them all like flies in the moment. Love have got different ideas. Good paranoia. Yeah, Orb's gonna be pluming here. Good movement as well to just topple themselves up onto the box. Showing a P, just the one before eventually falling. Smoke timing, blocks off the heaven angle, but there's a slightest gap, can't quite nail it. Leaf was looking for an easy shot there. A few spam kills as well. Trent tucked close and a bit of a one and done, and it's really just a one and none. I'm not sure I'd want to push that, Zeno, because you know that there's a player inside there with a Marshall. Marshall will do it. Hold up, this is eventually going away at G2. I mean, he's picked up this upgrade now, and Leaf, Yes, his position is noted and known. Aspas, but it's the win out. This fight, he's being distracted. Flying right over him with the satchels in play. Icy, making all sorts of distractions. Up and over you go, but you ran out of bullets. The right click. Only the one. Leaf, with that upgrade that he was afforded. That is a thrifty round. Control from Aspas might have given the game away here, though. Oh, Trent. Odin in his hands. Lots of bodies. The war drops, though. That's a classic play. You've got to be ready for that one as well. King's pit. G2 have got to put up some resistance uh, here. Looks more than winnable. Paranoia flying as fast. He's not shying away. He's brought down though. I see that turn his old as well. Showstopper here with a rocket. Rebounding potentially. Waiting. And it does strike back. Even anticipating that re-swing through the smoke. It's all heads up. And there was danger there, Josh. You're right. Station from Valin. Very, very ready for it. What ults will even be offloaded. So they definitely want to take the initiative forward here with a seize, and they collapse Spike right down. through the choke point. But still, the plant does need to go down here. And time was running short, left. still. It clears the way all the way through, even connecting onto that kill and to leave. I don't know why he's taking that fight he's out wide. He's trying to break the lockdown there. Up smoke, up, cuts up the angle. One more approach away for G2. Paranoia's good, One though. Satchel oh. forward! Mazzino, no way! <laughs> I was. I'll never find that footing. Zeno TP'd forwards. Valen, you really seek to try and refight this one. They're not even thinking about it. Mazzino again. The difference maker. PV4 knows that he can't make a normal defense work. Jonah on an off angle, another kind of hero setup. Should get traded immediately, surely. Surely. Locking it, ADS. Bulldog. And it's just biting them to pieces. Shredded in place. Decayed of vulnerability, all can't really get counter spammed. Penetration just not good enough with the Phantom or Abandoned. hesitation in the left camp. They're calling for which direction to even go into here with a paranoia to really just supplement and help with the support. If you till waiting for that wall to go down, Mazzino, he wins the fight out eventually. Snake bite. Mazzino wasn't quite ready. Yeah, Mazzino wasn't ready for it, but he's going to be spraying through. Six bullets got to reload. And now the fight comes through. There's a horde to set that one up and forwards. Tex still onto the angle, but now the last one left. Last man standing. Not for much longer. G2. Got a tag. One with the nades. He's a little bit delayed. G2's flood defense here is going to be massive. Nightfall, showstopper, how to live, hold on. So fast through it, I see. This rocket that could have been a difference maker. They want to take the fight straight to them, just holding and locking down that choke point. That is the waterfall angle. Or the tails are trails. And not going to be stopping them. I mean, the sound cues cut away. It matters not for them. But Lev have just stolen one back at the final hour. And the money was bad. Yep. Barely any holes to work with. And yeah, it's a 7-5 finish. Flawless in the end. Because he's going to be able to backstab the Lev players when they go for the retake. Here comes Lev. Nade flying forwards. Doesn't really set him up nicely for that fight here, but Mazzino is going to be rapid. Right through the approach there, but not expecting it. Jonah P. Touch corner. Right click's not doing it. But just down to King. Only 48 health. He's got a spot out. Multiple players, finds the kill, but already the time's ticking. Already drifting away from him, pistol round. Door opens, about 40 seconds into the mark now for G2 to start to make some movement around the map. Nade forwards here, but they haven't cleared out. Come! This guy is tearing him apart across five, set up balance. There's that response, but he's been softened up down to seven HP. 30 seconds left. 
does have the spike, but just yet yeah, not anticipating that position. So, Lev would not need rebounding forwards with some kills. Need to be found here on the G2 side. They can't just give all this ground freely gained. Aspas, now is the time to let loose with it. And a rocket, it's a racket, not too much more past that. The rifles really seem to be doing most of the work. Junipedo, plan for Mound, they're still having to clear out these players and they are doubled up onto it. Really miscommunication, but eventually getting onto it with the defuse, making sure that they can shut down that G2. He's gonna have that ult to show stop it. Does he choose to use it here? Yes. Maybe to offset it at least, making a nice and even flying forwards. Maybe not the intended target, but I think he was just hoping it would catch on to someone. Find themselves advantage here into the post, still holding those close positions. It's up to Lev really to use that Utah to try and clear it. It's Paranorian Peak, and that is beautiful. Casino, good timing and discipline taken with it. Satchel forward from Aspas. Smoke up, horn broken. Close corner by Valin, not anticipated. And this guy, a thorn in their side here. Leave it to Aspas once more, but it is an unwinnable situation. It should be. It needs to keep this gun. Not entirely. The end of the world if he does lose it. 5.8k to his name. Big rubble fight now. Massive one. This one could just turn the tide and fighting all the way through. I mean, listen, lit up like beacons here, but no kills really to be collected. Running through them with all that util. I mean, they're just choked Spike entirely. Can't get past the snake pipes. And Leaf. Almost the entire chamber expended there. Got to be respected here. 30 seconds left. Not quite though, Aspas. Look at this guy. I mean, he just sends flying for the nade. will get out, so he's not quite detained. Trent, he's beamed down in the approach. And yes, detained, but I see. He needs to follow through with this one. He needs a few more kills right into the choke point. There goes the nade. It just prevent that one with the pit drop. Down, now the showstopper. Aspas, he's finding that value, finding that work down. Three left to stand for G2. And the hopes and dreams of this series, they stand. And they might just fall right here, right now. But G2, from the moor almost. Last pulling it back into standing. their hands. And it turns just like that. Asmas again left in this spot. Yeah. Double up though, off angles yeah. from Lev. Guns, yeah. barrels might the be timing. spotted. This game of timing is just brutal. G2 picked to pieces here as they look to just re-aggress over towards A and they just don't expect King to bait and switch play. Straight from the paybook of Lev. I mean, they pulled this one out earlier. Find any sort of advantage in the round, but it is wrapped up. Surely it left. should be. It's a mountain to overcome here, but Lev tested, pushed. Trent finds it. At least one kill to stay alive. A bit of breathing room into the round, but not surely the series tapping. Not even sticking here into it. Paranoia in his face. Wide face, Mazzino. He finds that finishing blow. And Leviathan, they were pushed. They were tested in this series.